And here, here comes Hill. 10 to the 5. Barreling end zone. Touchdown. First, I just had to get to my O-line. You know, I had one guy to miss. I seen a guy to go around. So, I like, this is my opportunity. You know, I got to win this one-on-one -on -one battle. You know, I just put my head down, just push it in. And that's what I did. Hello and welcome to Packers Daily. Green Bay may have a one, two, three puncher running back with the arrival of Kylan Hill. The seventh round underdog can be an outside fighter, but he's also not afraid of going toe to toe. And Saturday's matchup at the goal line was a unanimous decision for Kylan Hill. He's got really good explosiveness. He can stick his foot in the ground and make the cuts. You know, it's just gonna be how fast can we get him to, to be really consistent. Then there's A.J. Dillon. At two and two quarters, the second year heavyweight goes right for the body, bullying defenders into the turf. Then inside the gold zone, Dillon can deliver the knockout blow. You talk about roadkill, somebody better call the DNR because there's tons of it all over <laughs> Lambeau Field. And for the main event, Pro Bowler Aaron Jones. 33 can bob and weave with the best of them, but watch out for his haymaker. Aaron Jones is a 10-round guy who can most definitely go the distance. He's got a chance in the 10 to the 5 to the end zone. Touchdown! Before we go, I'd like to congratulate my partner, Wayne Larrabee, on his induction into the Wisconsin Broadcasters Hall of Fame. After 22 years and 364 games, I know one thing for sure. He is the best in the business, bar none. Congratulations, Wayne. Very well deserved.